girl. I, I think- <laughs> I'm gonna need you to rein it back, like as far back as you can. Oh You're my dripping God. all on your titties. <laughs> Welcome back, nerds, geeks, and weebs. It's your host, Arden. And Jamie. And we're, we're back, back with, with more Dunkin' Rumpa 2. We're going to the restaurant. It's restaurant time. Let's do it. I'm hungry. <laughs> That's my secret cap. I'm, I'm always hungry. hungry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, hey, Nagito. <clears throat> you know, like, barring the terrible violence and, like, dread, mm. it'd be a cool place to vacation. Yeah, like, it looks like it's, a cabana fucking like yeah that's like that's a cool setup with yeah. all the little cabins I'm like mm-hmm. yeah I'd vacation there <sighs> not everyone is as strong as Byakuya I've never thought about having to overcome anything before it's not like I just run away from my problems but it's more like I was just living my life without even thinking about them at all even so I was still able to live must be fucking nice <laughs> right but this <laughs> But this is different. Sorry. Uh, sorry, I was being too negative. No, I understand. I'm the same as well. But now that we've talked, I feel assured once again. Being loners won't get us anywhere. That's why I think we should all help each other out. Also, I think we need to get stronger. An ordeal like this is what'll make us cling to hope. Yeah, you're probably right. Bye now. Well, I'll be heading to the restaurant now. Bye. <laughs> Mr. Gretchen. Mr. Gretchen. Mr. Hair full Mr. of Hair full secrets. It's full of secrets. <laughs> oh my god. Click on Mikan. Uh, hello. G- good morning. Yeah, good morning. <laughs> what is it? I just said good morning. Why is she so shocked? <laughs> my first time greeting someone, and I was actually greeted back. I'm so happy. What kind of life do you live? Poor, sweet, baby cinnamon roll. Right. Uh, um, could you do it one more time? One more time. Uh, hello. <laughs> good morning. G- good morning. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of life is she having? Just fucking... <laughs> oh, baby girl. <laughs> time for some psychopath time. Yeah, yeah. Jeez. I'm so sleepy. Hey, you're not the sleepy one. The video game girl is, okay? Right. She's the only one that's allowed to be sleepy. She doesn't look sleepy. <laughs> Mr. Ham Hands is so selfish. It's totally fine to spend the morning sleeping in. Okay, for, this is the one time I'll agree. But if we need to eat breakfast anyway, what's wrong with eating it together? Hmm. Well, I like to spend my breakfast eating sweets in my room. That's already fine. Um. Eating sweets for breakfast is bad for your health. You're consuming too many sugars and fats. Hey! Who made you my doctor? Don't speak to me without my permission. I'm sorry. <laughs> Jeez, listening to this ugly bitch's crying in the morning makes me so sick. <laughs> Hiyoko, you definitely have the ultimate bad attitude. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mr. Punny, first thing in the morning. Right. Scottish girl time. Hey. Good morning, Hajime. Yeah, good morning. Jeez, what's with a sullen face? Hmm. Well, I guess I'm not one to talk. I couldn't really sleep last night. I had a lot on my mind, and I don't know if I'll ever get the answers I'm looking for. Aww. Man, just for kicks, I should prepare some yummy desserts and tea and invite some people to come chat with me. I want yummy desserts and tea. You want yummy desserts and tea? I like yummy desserts Let's and go. tea. Let's go. Who fucking... says no to that? Right? Got it. Ah, just so you know, it's gonna be a girls only gathering. Don't expect the boys to be invited. Well, fuck off then. Uh-huh. Man, sounds like an excuse for some girl talk. What do girls even talk about? I guess guys will never know. <laughs> That's right, top secret. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll go on ahead. You better hurry and go to the restaurant. Top secret. Top secret. So I'll, I'll 100%. never know. It's just, it's a mystery. Girl secrets only. <laughs> secrets. It's. <laughs> Conversation full of secrets. I'm spinning in circles because I thought there might be more people out here. Fuck it, I'm going in. Yay! Meow. <laughs> Meow. Good num num numbing. What? Yes. I thought of a greeting for when we all eat breakfast together. It's a revolutionary new phrase that combines good morning and nom 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 at the same time. <laughs> This is definitely the new hip thing to say. In fact, I'll make sure it's the new hip thing to say. Wait, I'm gonna... <laughs> good. good nom nom nomming. <laughs> S- 
So I'm going to go tell everyone. <laughs> Even if she makes it popular, it'll still be limited to this island. It's what an inside joke is, bud. Get with it, my right? dude. Right? Come on. Good morning, Chiaki. Uh, hey. That's right. She has to think about everything before she, right. before she says it. Good morning. What was that pause for? Well, I'm in the middle of doing combo strings. I couldn't really reply. That's fair, too. Doing what? Hmm. I guess it's almost time. I'll go to the restaurant then. Did I interrupt something she was doing? Yeah, buddy, she's fucking labbing shit out. Have you ever played a fighting game before? She's fucking busy, my right? guy. I'm busy doing that fucking video game girl shit. Stuffing things. Stuffing things, Lori. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Several people were already at the restaurant. <laughs> Okie dokie. Right? No lines for us. But nobody was talking. Not a single word. While they sat there, the people who were late began to arrive as well. Late! Penalty! <laughs> made you wait. Is everyone here? Huh? It seems Fuyuhiko is not here yet. <laughs> Maybe he already got killed. Jesus. <laughs> Dead bodies already? No. Don't go killing people off. I saw him outside earlier. However, he told me he would not be joining us this morning. Hm. Why does he have to act like a lone wolf at a time like this? Maybe. C could he? Is he thinking of a plan to kill someone by himself? You must not. Kazuichi, you should not doubt your friend. Hey, hey, hey. Well, he's a Yakuza, isn't he? Do you understand what that means? He's part of the Japanese mafia. Hmm. I presume he's the kind of person who would not come even if we summoned him. That's fine. I guess it can't be helped. We should just talk among ourselves. Someone can fill him in later. Talk? What are we going to talk about? Rejoice. I have decided to throw a party tonight. Huh? A p party? That's right. A huge party that will last from sundown to sunrise. What the? Party till the sun comes up. This is your leader's order. Just so we're clear, I will not allow any absences. Your attendance at this party is absolutely mandatory. Huh? Hey, now's not the time to talk about stuff like partying. Hmm. On the contrary, there is no better time than this. Hmm. But still, we really shouldn't be partying. Wait. Um, hold on. I agree with Byakuya. It doesn't do us any good to stay bummed out like this. Hey. In fact, because of the situation we're in, it's probably best if we all strengthen our friendships with one another. <laughs> That's what you thought too, right? That's why you want to throw a party. Hmm. It doesn't matter why I'm doing it. Anyway, it is of vital importance that we all stay in one place tonight. You fiend. You say that with such significance. It's all clear now. It's decided. We're having ourselves a party. But... Even so, I'm not sure it needs to last all night. Stop talking. If I thought that, I would have made that clear from the beginning. I'm sorry. I I'm terribly sorry. I'm so, so sorry for trying to meddle with your plan. I see. It's important to be flexible in situations like this. Perhaps a diversion from all this is just what we need. Yahoo! Then let's party hard! Party hardy. Ah, in that case, I'll put my amazing cooking skills on display for you guys. Hmm. Where is this party going to be held? Would this restaurant be okay? Hmm. No, this won't do. We need a location that's impervious to interference from outsiders. A place even Monokuma cannot enter. What we need is an enclosed space. Um, an enclosed space? How pitiful. If the restaurant won't do, then neither will the lobby. That's not nearly enclosed enough. Um, I always want to flow into the Scottish accent like you do. I don't know. <laughs> it's Nor addictive. will the cottages. <laughs> Nor will the cottages. <laughs> With so many people, we'll all be pressed up against each other. I didn't mean to say it like that, but... God. It all comes out fiendish. He's like, I'm gonna make shit together. You're good, you're good. Get it together. Get, get, get it together, Summer. Put your shit. <laughs> get it to a so it's together. Take it to the shit store and sell it. I don't care. <laughs> Just get it together. No will the cottages. With so many people, we would all be pressed up against each other. Mm -hmm. But if you want to be pressed up against each other, then a cottage is clearly the best choice. You knew it was fucking, you knew it was coming. I can't even with him anymore. Right. Like, I can't stop it. Pressing up against ladies without sneaking aboard the women-only train and drag. I feel so lucky. 
What <laughs> the actual? What kind of fuck? shenanigans? Is How it? is this dude not in prison? Right. There's something wrong with you. <laughs> I can't believe how comfortable you are with saying your perverted thoughts out loud. <laughs> I may be a pervert, but I'm the kind of pervert everybody likes. False. <laughs> Fucking. I don't know where you got that idea, bud. Delusional. <laughs> your confidence is seriously impressive. Hey. Then how about that old looking building near this hotel? Huh? That run down place? You're right. Yeah, but if we do our best to clean it, I think it'd be perfect. Plus, it's basically the only place that meets our needs for an enclosed space, right? However. Indeed. However, Monami has forbidden us from entering that old place. As I recall, it's in the middle of being renovated. Ding, 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 ding. I have heard your conversation. Heard it with all my very own ears. <clears throat> I have good ears, because I'm a rabbit. <laughs> I see. Oh, so you use your ears. That's strange. Al the cat just bit me. Molly. <laughs> Don't be like, pet me and then bite me while I'm trying you to You just fucking... came over here, showed us your Ohio, and then starts a <laughs> bite. Ohio! Anyway. You can thank my husband for that one. He calls, it a, he calls a cat butts Ohio. It, any. Any cat butts? The, the, the Ohio. The <laughs> Ohio. Because Ohio. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Ohio. <laughs> God damn it. Huh? Hmm. Then what is the reason for those surveillance cameras? Are they for Monokuma's eyes only? <laughs> Hello! She looks so disappointed. That's fine. Well, it is of no concern. We can settle that issue another time. Listen. Regarding the old building, you came to tell us something about it, right? <laughs> <laughs> yes, if it strengthens everyone's bonds with each other, then I will not hesitate to cooperate. I shall allow it. So in that case, I will allow you to enter the old building. I'll cooperate so we can all party together. Yeah. <laughs> together? That's not going to happen because you're so disgusting. <laughs> Understand? Do yourself a favor and stay away from mirrors. You'll be grossed out by what you see. <laughs> Your kind words make me want to cry. <laughs> what the fuck? Um, so we're all good with the old building? And... Then what about the preparations? If it's in the middle of a renovation, don't we need to clean it first? Wow. I have never done the dirty work known as cleaning before. I'm excited to finally experience it. Hey, hey, hey! No way! There's no way we can dirty our dear princess's hands! Christ. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to do it either. Jeez. What? Nobody's gonna do it? Get your hey. finger out your nose, boy. <laughs> in that case, why don't we decide by a random drawing? Random drawing? Actually... To be honest, I already prepared a drawing because I assumed something like this would happen. To go to the trouble of preparing this, just what did you think would happen? See? Whoever draws the chopstick with the red mark on it will be in charge of cleaning, okay? Does that sound fair? Judgment! Well then, let us entrust our destinies to the whims of this drawing. All right. Well, no hard feelings. One by one, everybody took turns pulling the chopsticks Nagito held in his hand. And when it was all said and done... What? Huh? I'm left with the red mark? <laughs> For someone called the ultimate lucky student, you don't seem very lucky right now. <laughs> mm, I guess it can't be helped. All right. Well, if it's just cleaning, leave it to me. I'm actually pretty good at it. I thought so. You seem like you'd make a good stay-at-home dad. Aww. <laughs> that is kind of sweet. Yeah. I'll take that as a compliment. You should. Okay. I'll handle the cooking. Nope. <laughs> God, I'm sorry. You're fucking uh, nope. breaking every time. <laughs> All right. First, I need to prepare my ingredients. Then I'll start cooking at the old building. There's no mistaking it. I, Teru Teru Hanamura, will go all out. I will prepare the world's tastiest dishes for you all. I'd rather starve. <laughs> then I just need to pass along the party details to Fuyuhiko. Let's go about our business then. After Monokuma's nightly announcement, we'll meet at the old building. Many hours later. There we go. Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an a really fool. It is now 10 p.m. Please return to your rooms and relax. 
Let the sound of the ocean gently rock you to sleep. Now then, sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Good night, he says. Whatever. I have a party to attend. You can't tell me what to do anymore. You're not my dad. <laughs> Time to go to the old building by the hotel. Time to go to oh, literally my fucking next door. Okay, fine, fine. I'll walk there, I guess. Hey, Monkey! Hey. Oh, my, my. Are you also here for the party? Why else would I be here? Anyway, what are you doing in a place like this? <laughs> I'm doing a little exercise so I can enjoy all the yummy food we're gonna eat. She plans ahead. I'm ex. <laughs> you don't even want to say I the words. I don't even want to say it. Yeah. I'm excited to eat Terra Terra's cooking. Yeah, especially since he's the ultimate cook. <laughs> Meanwhile, we're like, what is he putting in the fucking? <laughs> Not enough bleach in the world to wash my hands. <clears throat> it's about time for the party. I'm really excited. Um, uh, I'll do my best to not be in the way, so it's fine if I st stay here, right? Are you really worrying about something like that? Uh, yes! Poor girl. <clears throat> <clears throat> I let Fuyuhiko know about the party, but he didn't look too pleased about it. He doesn't ever seem too pleased about anything. <laughs> right. Oh, maybe he's the one that did. I fucking hope not. That, that begs the question, who is going to die first? Yeah, that's that's what I'm wondering. Man, so this is the old building. Compared to the hotel, it definitely looks worse for the wear. You're here. Now then, stand up straight and raise your arms. Why do I have to do that? You gotta buy me dinner first. <laughs> because I need to do a body check. Again, <laughs> you gonna buy me dinner first, bud? Body check? Since I'm the one hosting the party, it's necessary for me to take all possible security measures. Listen. I already promised that I would not allow even one person to become a victim. I get it. And so, I reluctantly raised my arms and stood up straight. <coughs> Byakuya went ahead and thoroughly searched me, starting with my legs and working his way up. Girl, I see. <laughs> it appears you haven't brought anything dangerous. Of course I haven't. Also, was that like... <laughs> that sounds slightly insulting. I mean... <laughs> Very well, I shall allow you to enter. Hmm? It was at that moment that I noticed a strange item near where Byakuya was standing. Metal cases. What? Duralumin, actually. I found them at the supermarket. This one is used to store any dangerous items I find during body checks. The other one is for... Well, let's just say it's for emergencies only. Yo, weapons? <laughs> right? What do you mean emergencies? Stop talking. Don't worry about it. The others are already here, gathered at the dining hall in the back. Go there and wait. As soon as he said that, Byakuya turned his back to me. I guess that's the end of our talk, but... He's so cautious. I didn't expect him to perform a body check. And what did he mean by emergencies only? Oh, snap. Alright, I guess we're gonna go talk to some mofos. Toilet. This bathroom appears to be unisex. I don't need to go now. I should hurry over to the dining hall. I don't have to shit yet. <laughs> Speaking of shit. <laughs> There's a tantalizing aroma wafting from the kitchen. Jeez. However, Bianca, you will yell at me if I don't go straight to the dining hall. You should head over there as well. Bet. All right. Uh, I guess it's this way then. Kitchen. Oh, I'm going to the kitchen. All the windows in here are bolted. I'll, we'll have to go check that out. All right. It's a knife set. I never knew there were so many different types of knives. I don't know anything about knives, but Terry Terry probably knows what each knife is used for. Well, more importantly, I should head over to the dining hall for now. Fucking, all right, railroad me. Hello there. Oh, did you need something? Don't worry. I've already prepared all of the dishes. Or rather, did you want me to cook you up too? I want to see that even mean. He's out to get it, where God. he can get it. <laughs> Christ. All right, fine, whatever. We're going to the dining hall. Surprised yeah. there's any freaking We're, blood in him left to light man. up his cheeks. But he's out here like, See, hey, Sonya. All the little things are bolted, the windows. You're are right, dark. you're right. That's, that's looking that real familiar. Sucks. Yeah. All right. 
see, I see. So, this is what the inside looks like. There are so many gaps in the wooden floor. Is that because it's so old? All right. I must tread carefully so my feet do not stumble. My adventurous heart is pounding with excitement. <laughs> I guess when you're a princess, even little things seem exciting. <laughs> There's a joke in there. That's all yeah. I'm going to say. Oh, my Lord. I wasn't going to say it. Right. Oh, that's not the dining hall. Hello. Um, fucking, Ooh, let's just. Oh, shit to. Yeah. Shit to look at? Shit to look at. These are irons. No. Were they used to prepare the tablecloth? If so, why do you need three? Should head over to the dining. All right, okay, okay. So basically, that's that's just going to be it for now. They really want us to go to the dining hall. Right, I have a strong feeling everything will be worth looking at after the dining hall. Right. I have a feeling we're going to be trapped in here after the dining hall. Oh, God. Because isn't this oh my God, suspiciously there's... looking like something? Yeah, this is like... <laughs> cabin in the woods. Is fucking... this not familiar? Right. Here we go. Oh, hell yeah. Ah, uh, Hajime, how do you like it? What do you mean? See, I decorated the whole dining hall for the party. I even laid out the carpet, too. Really? Even the carpet? Yep. I brought it up from the supermarket. That place sure does seem to have everything. <laughs> Convenient. Mm -hmm. I actually wanted to cover the whole floor, but I guess the carpet wasn't big enough. <sighs> there was a lot of dust and cobwebs all over the place, too. It took me all day to clean the dining hall just because of that. There's no way I could handle being stuck cleaning the whole day. You're commendable, Nagito. Thanks. Yeah, thanks. Just be talking to everybody. Gross. That creep Biakia rubbed his ham hands all over me and called it a body check. More like sexual harassment. That's not what it is. He did the same thing to the guys, too. <laughs> so, I feel like he was getting frisky while he was frisking me. What? I'm pretty in demand, you know. For the for all the wrong fucking reasons. You're just kidding. <laughs> I'm worried about Monokuma showing up. If he finds out we're having a party, there's no way he'll leave us alone. So... We gotta do something about it. You're right. We should do something. Super difficult. I wonder if someone can do something about it. Hmm, I wonder. Hmm, I wonder. <laughs> so we're on the same page then. I'm not sure I understand. <laughs> Sometimes there's just nothing behind them pretty little pink eyes. <laughs> you are spare parts, <laughs> bud. <laughs> this old place sure is run down. I feel bad Nagito went to all this trouble cleaning it. Even cleaning has its limits. See, check out the floorboards. Maybe the wood shrank because of deterioration? Don't these open and seem dangerous to you? You're right. Aww. Well, the carpet is spread out enough to cover most of the floor, so I guess it won't be that big of a deal. Hey. But it might be best to tell Mikan to be careful. <laughs> uh. God. I, uh, man. Yeah, she is the type to trip over nothing. Rude but fair. <laughs> Ending up in the worst positions. Ugh. Man, that was so uncomfortable. Getting groped so thoroughly by a man. That was my worst nightmare. Um, oh, you mean the body check? How annoying. Plus, he got super pissed and started yelling at me when he noticed I had a wrench with me. Seriously, how friggin' annoying. It's your fault for having a wrench in the first place. Man. I just happened to find it at the airport. Carrying it around calms me down. But, Bianca, you put it in that Duralumin case of his. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> Sniffle. <laughs> I'm about to do it. My, I can't with my sinuses oh my right now. <clears throat> Good instincts. Even though that man is a lowly worm, it appears his cooking skills are most impressive indeed. Nevertheless, even his food cannot stand against the gourmet cuisine of the multiverse. <laughs> but he just says words. <laughs> he just out here saying words. Oh man! <laughs> Girl, I, I think, <laughs> I'm gonna need you to rein it back, like as far back as you can. Oh You're dripping God. all on yeah. your titties. 
Oh, man. You are not making it easy for me to defend you. Right <laughs> when they say Akane got that drip, they're not talking about her clothing. <laughs> I'm trying to be fair to all my girls here, but listen. <laughs> hey, what's up? <laughs> it's pointless. She can't even <laughs> fucking think. <laughs> <laughs> She's completely focused on the food. Same girl, honestly. Jeez. Like, uh, iron plates. That reminds me. I saw some similar looking iron plates in the hallway too. But why are those iron plates bolted onto the walls? To trap us inside! Right? All is not what it appears to be. Huh? Stay back. One of my four devas, Supernova Silver Fox San D, has seen what lies shrouded amidst the darkness. Though that iron plate appears to be bolted to the wall, it's actually bolted over what's known as a window. <laughs> <laughs> window? <laughs> Let me tell you this. There are no windows in this dining hall at all. I assume those iron plates are covering them. But why are iron plates covering the windows? The night is my domain. Hmm. San D, it appears your fur is rustling more than usual today. Hey, why are iron plates covering the windows? <laughs> Let's make history. Such a fine day. Countless lives gasp their first breath, and countless more go the way of all flesh. I guess he doesn't know. Uh, apparently not. <laughs> well, this building is in the middle of a renovation, so I guess that might have something to do with it, but this place sure has a creepy atmosphere because of that. Hmm. Suddenly, we heard the voice of the ultimate affluent protagonist <laughs> ring throughout the dining hall. I've made you wait. Thank you for waiting. A hey. hmm. Teru Teru is in the kitchen, and it appears for you Hiko did not come. I apologize. I did inform him about the party, but... Jeez. <laughs> that, I want that as a sound clip. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> it's not like you need to apologize, Peko. It's his fault for not coming. I explicitly stated that attendance was mandatory, but it's fine. If just one person is absent, that shouldn't pose a problem. I think he's dead as hell. <laughs> it could be. He won't be able to do anything. What do you mean by that? What? More importantly, hmm? Come on. Hey, what is that? An intense expression spread across Byaki's face as he looked at the table with various food dishes on it. Not possible. Dangerous. Fucking lord. As he stomped his way toward the table. Oh my god, bro! Hey, what are you doing? You're hogging all the food! No fair! <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> I don't care what you say, you're totally pigging out. I'm telling you, I'm not. Look carefully at this dish. It looks like delicious roasted meat. And just what is stabbed into this roasted meat? You don't have to eat it. It's an iron skewer. I mean, yeah, he could have slid the food off of that right. shit. That's right. This iron skewer is definitely a dangerous item. I must take full responsibility and collect it. <laughs> See, an unhealthy relationship with food. <laughs> it's all over this game. Hello? Man. <clears throat> hey, looks like everyone's here. I should go ahead and bring out the rest of the... Huh? What? Some messy eater ruined my arrangement! <laughs> Who made this dish? Um... That would be me, but, um, are you a food critic? What are you thinking? What are you plotting? Cooking with such dangerous items. No, 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 no. D-d-dangerous? That's churrasco! It's a South American meal where you stab meat on an iron skewer to cook it! Mm-hmm. It felt really tropical and exotic, so I thought it would totally fit the party's atmosphere. <laughs> These iron skewers are a problem. Why? Iron skewers aren't allowed either? If that's how you're acting, then there might be more skewers than just these. Let's go. Hey, Hajime, come with me. I need your help. Why me? Man. It's your fault for standing right in front of him. My condolences. <laughs> Lord, I, I'm just, I'm here, so I have to do things now. Byakuya's face bore an intense expression as I reluctantly followed him out of the dining hall. Oh. Um, I, I guess, uh, fucking, uh, oh, there he is. Oh, I was like, <laughs> Turn around. <laughs> Let's go. <clears throat> All right, this is the kitchen. We have to thoroughly inspect it to make sure there are no dangerous items. Thoroughly, huh? Piaki stomped into the kitchen, and I followed after him. 
Hey, look at that cartoonishly large piece of meat. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's get on with it then. Search this place thoroughly. 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 As he issued that order, Byakuyu began searching the whole kitchen from one end to the other. Hmm. Look, I found these. There are forks and knives on that shelf. Uh, don't tell me those two. Naturally. These are definitely dangerous items. If you're just eating, chopsticks are enough. <laughs> you can stab motherfuckers with chopsticks, too. After he said that, Byakuyu threw the forks and knives into the Duralumin case, one after the other. You're being very thorough about this. I think Buffy actually killed a vampire with a chopstick once. I, it would not surprise me. Um, <clears throat> just get the little things out the way here. Now's not the time to dwell on the surveillance camera. Okay, then why is it fucking look edible? <laughs> look edible. <laughs> um, this paper is. I see. It appears to be an equipment list for the kitchen. Twenty forks, twenty knives, twenty spoons, five iron skewers, three frying pans, twenty wine glasses. There are also iron plates for barbecue and even a portable stove for cooking hot pots. Hmm. Iron plates and a portable stove. I do recall seeing them on the shelf over there. This kitchen seems to be well kept. There should be no problems using it. Though the building is old, the kitchen is impressive. Compared to a normal restaurant, it's not too shabby. Very strange. But it's strange. One of the items on this list seems to be short by one. Uh, okay. There appear to be various types of knives, but these... What? Out of the question. Knives are far too dangerous. Hand them over to me. I'll safeguard them. <laughs> Byaku, you grabbed the knife from my hand and threw it into the Duralumin case with the rest. Of course. Uh, big ol' meaty boy? Chinese, Japanese, French, and Italian cuisine. Seafood dishes, too. There's even a huge piece of meat on the bone. That Teru Teru, he sure got fired up. I don't even know if I'd be able to eat that much food. I see. It seems there are no dangerous items, like that skewer in the churrasco earlier, inside that pile of food. That appears to be the case. Whew, I wouldn't have known what to do if he said fish bones and meat bones were also dangerous items. <laughs> Click on the paper again. Yeah. 20 forks, 20 knives, 20 spoons, 5 skewers, 3 frying pans, 20 wine glasses. Did it say one was missing? Yeah, it said one item was missing. How many ske skewers did fucking he get from inside there? I think only four. Because that's four. the only thing we've seen visually, yeah? I think there were only four skewers. I think there are only four? There are also iron plates for barbecue. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Okay, is there anything else? <clears throat> All right. Hey, is it necessary to go this far? Don't make me repeat myself. I'm doing this because it's necessary. If I'm to fulfill the promise I made to not let anyone become a victim, I must be extra vigilant. Really? Is that all? What? What do you mean? Well, I'm just assuming, but I think something must have happened to you. Mm. Mm. After all, you decided to throw a party so suddenly. I can't help but think there's a reason for that. Hmm. That's not it. I've been a distrustful person for as long as I can remember. Distrustful person? Huh. I don't really like to talk about my past, but it's fine. I'll just tell you a little bit of it. I cannot talk to others about my past. I suspect that my skeptical nature is partly to blame. Byakuya has a past he can't talk about? Hmm. Distrusting others and being distrusted in turn. For a long time, my life has been a living hell. It was inevitable that I would end up this way. <laughs> but in this kind of situation, my skeptical nature might be of good use. If we're to survive here, skepticism is necessary at all costs. By the way, that past you mentioned... That's enough. Now is not the time. However, one day, there will definitely be a time when I will be able to tell you about it. Hmm. If nothing happens and time passes for us peacefully, I will have no choice but to talk. That sounded pretty deep. I sort of feel like things are even more mysterious now, because he hasn't told me the whole story. It's not paranoia if they really have to get you. Uh, you ain't wrong. This guy... Might have a deep mystery hidden within him, deeper than I thought he'd have. Such silly talk. Hey, enough with the unnecessary banter. We'd better hurry and find the rest of those dangerous items. Yeah, got it. Even so, he sure works as hard. That's probably more in line with his actual personality, I bet. Huh? <laughs> oh boy. Why? The kitchen's a mess! What happened here? 
stop talking. Don't raise your annoying voice. I just removed all the dangerous items. Huh? There are no knives or forks. Why? How come? Don't make me repeat myself. I literally just said that I removed all the dangerous items. You're kidding, right? Don't tell me. You're treating cooking utensils like dangerous items. No, 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 no. Well, most of the dishes are finished. All I gotta do is arrange the plates so it's not a problem, but... But still! Ah! Hajime! Just stop it! Get off me! Eh? Not into that sort of thing? Well, that's a little depressing. Jesus. <laughs> Trust me, I'm the one who's depressed here. <laughs> hey, before you start getting all flirty, explain <laughs> this. <laughs> I checked the equipment list and there seems to be one iron skewer missing. Mm -hmm. Ah, so you caught that. Mm -hmm. Ah, that's right. As far as I know, that's been missing from the start. Mm. No matter how clean this place gets, stuff is still bound to go missing in an old building, right? Hmm. If it's been missing all along, we can't really do anything about it, right? Hm. You're right. There's no place to hide such a long skewer anyway. Very well. All I need to do is keep a watchful eye. Don't tell me you plan to keep a watchful eye all night long. Let's go. All right, let's go back. The other should be waiting for us. You too, Teru Teru. Come to the dining hall for now. Ah. Uh. <laughs> uh, okay. Jeez, he's such a pushy leader. Bet you I know where the skewer is. Friend of going somebody's ass. <laughs> 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 They're finally back! Hey, hey! Let's eat already. I'm starving. Hmm. There's still an issue we need to address first. Lies! Huh? An issue? All right. Who do I gotta beat the crap out of? Just say the word. I'll do it for you. That's enough. That won't be necessary. The issue is where to safeguard this Duralumen case that has all the confiscated dangerous items. Huh? Can't we just leave it here? Hmm. I've already put a lock on the case, so it shouldn't be a problem, but we should definitely up the security and keep it someplace safe. Um, someplace safe? Oh, there's a storage room at the back of this old building. I see. A storage room, huh? Even so, we can't leave the case alone in there. Then... Then someone should guard it. That would keep it safe, yes? Huh? Who? Who? I'll do it, of course. Uh, <laughs> uh, are you sure? I guess if you insist. It, just kidding. Aww. But it'll be lonely there by yourself. I don't mind. I'm really not good in situations where I have to be around lots of people anyway. She's an introvert. Uh -huh. <laughs> if I wrote a song about this, the title would definitely be Lonely Girl in the Storage Room. Lonely Girl in the Storage Room. <laughs> <laughs> However, Teru Teru has gone to the trouble of cooking. Is it all right for me to bring some of it with me? Okay. Yeah, that's totally fine. But... If you're going to do guard duty anyway, it might be better if you avoid the storage room. Why is that? Well, not only is the storage room packed with lots of stuff, it's hard to see in there and full of cobwebs. <laughs> also, I was so busy cleaning the dining hall that I didn't even have time to clean the storage room. If you stayed in there for a long time, I think it would be bad for your health. I see. In that case, why don't you guard it in the office? If I recall correctly, there's also a circuit breaker in there, too. It'd be a good idea to guard that as well. Yep. Yeah, the office sounds nice. I'm pretty sure it's not that dirty, either. Understood. So I need to be on guard duty at the office. Then I should get going. Have fun tonight, everyone. Taking with her the Duralumen case and a plate piled with food, Pekko left the dining hall. I see, I see. Hmm, seeing Pecco's back as she walks away makes me feel like she's got this super cool melancholy vibe. Huh? But shouldn't she have taken that other case with her too? This. No, this case is fine. That's weird. No fair. You're like the only one who got to bring their own stuff. Naturally. When you're as special as me, you get special privileges. <laughs> <laughs> when you put it that way, it's hard to argue with you. Listen. This Duralumen case stays with me at all times. I put the key to the other case in here as well. I will take full responsibility for watching over it. There's no way I can let anyone else handle this matter. <laughs> I can't with you, girl. Right? More importantly, we're all done now, right? Let's start the party. Stop talking. No, there's still more. God damn it, Byakuya. I'm hungry, dog. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. Ah. Uh, who do you want me to beat the crap out of? Hurry up and tell me already. 
<laughs> Seriously, it has nothing to do with that. Hmm. Actually, if you're volunteering, I do have one particular nuisance in mind. Uh-huh? Are you talking about... That's right. Monokuma, of course. He's the one thing that could obviously disrupt this party. I'll show you my serious side. All right. So you'll let me eat if I beat the crap out of Monokuma, right? Hold on. Wait a sec. If you actually pick a fight with that thing, you're just going to end up perforated. No. Are you telling me to wait till I starve to death? Hey. S starve to death? That's a little extreme. <laughs> Our opponent is not someone we can just fight. Rather... It's better if we use our heads and think of a plan. Hey, hey. I'll do something about it. Now she... Somebody should do something about right? it. Someone should definitely do something about it. I'll, I'll do, do something, something about, about it. it. <laughs> what? Do something. You. Hey, hey. Hey, now. What can a girl like you do? You're just going to put yourself in danger. Uh -huh. Nope. Right? Nope. Uh. I won't. It's not like I'll personally do something. You won't? <laughs> Do you intend to utilize Monomi? Yep. Yeah, if I can talk her into helping us. She might be able to keep Monokuma at bay. At least, that's what I think. <gasps> that's probably a good idea. She looks like the type that's easily manipulated. <laughs> oh, poor baby. <laughs> Plus, Monomi and Monokuma totally have a rivalry going on. <laughs> well, it's a pretty one-sided rivalry. <laughs> Are you okay? But will you really be okay, Chiaki? I still think it's dangerous. It's gonna be fine. I'll be fine. If things get dangerous, I'll just run away as fast as I can. Well then, I'll be going now. What is this feeling? I feel somewhat uneasy. It's not like I have a bad feeling about this, but something feels off. <sighs> <laughs> so, it's all settled, right? Then, can we... <laughs> You're right. Let's begin. Uh, Shit! All right! <laughs> <laughs> She's very enthusiastic. Girl, put them titties <laughs> up. Girl's got buttons flying off her shirt. She's she so ain't even got no bra on. She's just out here free nippling it. Like <laughs> we, need, we need to do something about this girl. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> so the banquet has finally commenced. <laughs> you better keep me entertained. Oh, my lord. And with that, the party started. <laughs>